You are going to eat that entire hay pile before I even finish the video. Move away from the hay. No, move, Steve. Move away from the hay. You do not need to eat more hay. Okay, you are fine. Everything is fine. <laughs> Steve, <laughs> move away from the hay. Gosh, my voice sounds bleh. Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be looking over the newest bunch of swim updates, along with some other updates on my channel. And we're just gonna be having some fun, showing some cute sleeping horses and eating and all of that stuff. I know a lot of you guys watched my channel for swim and I don't wanna completely erase that from my channel. So I'm going to be trying and keeping up with my RRP and a lot of the other swim content. You know, my OG videos where I used to just vlog and just walk around and that kind of thing. I'm gonna try and get back into those because I really do miss them. Just a little reminder that I am not on the swim team anymore, so if you guys have any questions, bugs, or concerns, please go over to the swim discord. I will not be answering any swim related questions unless I know them for sure in the comments, and I do encourage you guys to go look at the discord first. Also, I'm going to be working with the sunflower barn today. Oh, oh my gosh, I feel like a, a wave just hit me. Oh my gosh, I feel like a, a wave just hit me. I'm gonna be working at the Sunflower Barn today to show you guys all the updates. This is going to be released for free soon, very, very soon. I just have to film a few more things for it. And it'll be released on Ko-Fi for anybody who wants to put it in their world. It'll also be offered with different roof tiles and it'll be offered with a different option for pretty much everything. So I'm very excited for that to make it to your PCs. If you like these types of videos, make sure to like and subscribe. It helps my small channel grow and it helps me be able to make these types of videos. All right, let's get right into it. Press rewind and see what we All right, so the first thing I wanna show is the group of toys. Now these are not functional at the moment, they're just for decoration, but there was something in the Discord about it, them possibly being functional in the future. I'm gonna be using the stalls for some of them. Um, let me go ahead and use a chain for one of these. Actually, I'm gonna use a coated chain. Jolly apple snack toy can be like hung from a chain and your horse can just have a cute little snack. That's kind of like swim horse height, but if you have a vanilla horse or like a shorter horse, you can always do that instead as well. This is kind of like an awkward placement. I don't suggest putting it in a placement like that, but I don't really have anywhere to hang down the treat. So uh, yeah, then we have the salt lick toy. I haven't really seen a salt lick like this before. Usually the salt licks I see are like tied to a rope type uh, salt licks, but then again, I don't really shop for salt licks very often. I have the same thing as the uh, Jolly Apple Snack and we have the uh, string treats toy. I don't know why the name is like that. It's throwing me off so bad. This reminds me of like one of those like parrot toys, you know, the ones where they can like interact with. It has a good bit of detail if you look up close. Hopefully in the future, we can maybe see them eat the treat stick toy string thing. <laughs> the next thing we have is the Jolly Ball with the hay inside of it. Um, I don't know if this is meant to be levitating, but every time I look at it, uh, it's levitating. So it may be one of those that you need to place in a frame. It is currently levitating. Let's go and grab an invisible frame. Yeah, no, okay. So it just, it has a little bit of a, a levitation thing, you know, maybe it just has superpowers like that. I'm levitating. Jolly ball toy. It only comes in this color currently, so I hope there's more colors offered soon because I really do love the Jolly Balls. I also love that they made them a little bit bigger because usually certain mods or texture packs or CIT packs make Jolly Balls pretty small. So since they're fit for swim horses, they're a little bit bigger, which is really cool. One of my favorites, the Scratchy Pole. You guys know those videos of like those cows out in the field getting the best scratch of their life on this little pole with like bristles on it? This is a scratchy pole. This is basically something that cattle or even horses can use. This is actually a really nice way for horses to clean themselves IRL too, because a lot of times wild horses IRL, they brush up against bushes, they brush up against branches, anything that they can kind of scratch themselves with or even groom themselves with. Every time I see this, I think of the little cow videos of them like rubbing their faces. <laughs> 
slow feed hay. Uh, I don't know if this is a toy. I guess it just like gets rolled or something. It looks like the slow feeder. If you go and look at the slow feeder, um, let's grab the pink one for reference, but it's a ball. So I guess it's supposed to like roll and the horses are supposed to eat out of it as it rolls, that kind of thing. I'm not sure how limited the design is, so I'm not gonna like pick on it too much, but I don't know. It's kind of close to the slow feeder. All right, for this one, I'm gonna get a paddock feeder and we're gonna show the horses eating, hopefully. The food and water levels are, they're not too bad. The water could be better. Actually, let me get a trough and fill it with water for the horse. I'm gonna get you some water. Oopsies. There you go. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> Are you drinking more? Oh my God. Oh, but his water level isn't up yet. That's okay. Oh my gosh, that was so cute. Do you want more? Like take take the entire trough. I don't care. Take it. Yeah, drink, drink whatever you want. This is your trough, queen, king, whatever you are. Oh my God, I'm so excited. The reason I'm excited is because we, oh, what? <laughs> the reason I'm so excited is because we haven't had functional food since like the release of Swem for 1.16. I remember when it did work, and then it kind of broke. I think it was attempted to be worked on. I'm not gonna say like it was never like attempted to be fixed. You guys know that dev work, it's not very easy. So I do understand that there wasn't really much they could do for 1.16, but the fact that they're bringing this to 1.18 is very exciting. I'm so happy. That alone just made my entire day. And that's saying something. Oh, it already went to the bathroom. Would you look at that? I mean, the water had to go somewhere, right? Horsey, go grab some food. Look, I put some food here for you. Can it only feed like from slow feeders? I don't think it can only feed from slow feeders, right? There's food right there. I can even put food right there if you want. Actually, let me put some food over here. You have options. You you have so many options. You have the paddock feeder, the slow feeder, and the bale. Take your pick. Yeah, I'm gonna set its hunger to one because it's gonna make it hungry. I don't think it's hungry enough to eat right now. And I wanted to eat for the video. I'm a little too excited to see a pixelated horse eat. I'm gonna put it over here so I can see if it'll go up on like its own choice or if it's just like AI just walking around, you know? Oh, nope, it's walking over. Okay, it's drinking. That's so cute. Let's see. Oh, you have a lot to go. Yeah, drink the entire trough, you'll need it. It is not currently bringing up the food or water level. The update just came out, so I'm not like too worried about bugs. They will be fixed, they'll be worked on, but, but the fact that we already have the food system is great like look right here food <gasps> maybe like you have so many choices please <laughs> wait do the horses follow you now with the lead i don't know if that's like an ai that's been worked on you know how the horses would always like follow you kind of weird well they still kind of do that they still kind of do their little dancey dance as they're following but it looks like it's gotten a little bit better i don't know if that's been worked on or if that's 1.18 or you know mechanics i'm gonna name this one finch you know like the bird the finch i don't know that or pecan i feel like if i name it pecan though someone's gonna be in the comments like oh my god it's pecan because there's people that pronounce it pecan i'm not hating but i'm hating at the same time we're gonna go bring um finch into the barn and <laughs> i'm sorry i keep on forgetting that's on my head gonna bring him into the barn and also show how to use the feed bins because i i'm not gonna lie i completely forgot about those we're also gonna bring finch into a stall that has food and water already provided because i'm wondering if if they're in a smaller area are they more encouraged to eat you know oh i'm so sorry i keep on doing that all right yep going right over to the water okay someone's thirsty i'm a little bit worried that they're not eating the grain right now yeah the food and water levels aren't moving right now so that's definitely a bug. I'm sure they probably already mentioned it, so I'm Discord. Okay, how about if I give you like a flake of hay? Oh wait, oh, water again? Yeah, that's okay. Uh, just so you guys know, if a horse drinks that much water that fast IRL, that is a red flag. Just so we're all like aware. If I didn't make it so that his food level or water level were so far down and he drank that much water, that would be a little concerning. Okay, well, we're gonna leave for now. I'm gonna go look at the feed bins and we're gonna check back and see in a little bit if uh finch has touched any of his food i'm not sure if that's a me problem if i'm doing something wrong i'm gonna make this the feed area anyway in this barn so may as well design it now with you guys watching we have all 16 minecraft colors plus all of the wood types i'm gonna go for a yellow one that or like an oak do we have whitewash oh darn we don't have whitewash that would be so cool if they made a whitewash one i think i like the oak one better are they functional 
I'm just wondering, am I the problem? Probably. Are you sure you're okay? I don't think I'm okay. Okay, you know what? I'm coming back to this one. I want to go see my horse sleep. The server is in the process of being built currently, so I don't have daylight cycle enabled. We're going to go ahead and force the daylight cycle to go down to nighttime, and we're going to see if my horse lays down. Did the horse eat? No, it didn't. Okay. Okay. <gasps> Are you eating food? Okay. So you only eat at nighttime, huh? I was like, oh my gosh, is it sleeping? No, it's just eating food. Just like me for real, a night feeder. We're gonna go put it outside in the pasture because I don't know if it's like too bright in the stall for it to sleep, but I wanna see if it just lays down in the pasture. All right, it's nighttime. Like there's their stars in the sky. Yeah, look at the pretty fishies and the lanterns. They light up. Oh, okay, gonna get a little drink out of the pond. It's so crazy to me to see this without people like on the back of the horse doing animations. Like I'm so used to people having to get online and do these animations. But this horse is doing it free, like free wills. Isn't it cool? Had a lot of water to drink and some hay. You know, like you want to yawn or something and you know sleep. This is basically just going to be me like twiddling my thumbs waiting for this horse to sleep because I just want to see them sleep so badly. Are you hydrated enough for bed now? <laughs> Can you sleep? Okay, you're eating. I was about to say, are we about to sleep? I don't think I remember putting this many fish in here, but I may be wrong. All right, let's try to summon another horse as well. Oh shoot, not the tea posing. I thought we got past this, no. I would think it would be in shadows, wouldn't it? Okay, all right. I'm about to lose it. How do I get into shadows? Let's go ahead and turn off shaders for now in order to prevent this. <gasps> Oh my gosh, my horses are sleeping. Wait, was shaders the problem? No. Okay, so if I have shaders off, they sleep. Let me go ahead and use the extreme that I was using. I'm so excited. Okay. I don't know why I'm talking quietly, like they can hear me or something. Look at the sleeping baby. Oh. 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 Um, so, uh meant to get grass. No, not that type of, that grass. You come here often or something or? You know that audio that's like, it's you and me and me and you and your friend Steve. boo doo 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 do Steve. <laughs> me and you and you and me, just us and your friend Steve. do 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 Steve. Okay, so they sleep. Let's try and set it to daytime. Okay, so they're up and going. Oh my gosh, running over to the water, sprinting over to the water. Yeah, go and go and eat some food. Now horses can go and eat and drink around the field. I'm so excited for like the herd stuff, you know, the horses going and eating and drinking together. Okay, so now we have Finch. Uh, I have a horse with that coat named Winnie, so I guess we'll just call it Winnie. And then their friend Steve to, you know, meet up with the trend and everything. <laughs> Ooh, ray tray shadows would be cool. Is this going to crash my PC? Maybe. Yeah, and they go to tea posing. Oh my gosh. My frames just drop so bad. Let's undo that. <laughs> Let me go to complimentary. I don't really like them anymore. Shader pack settings. This one has a lot more shadows. There we go. Entity shadows on. Let's turn it off. There we go. Okay, so if you're using complimentary, I know I advertised complimentary a long time ago and I still do kind of use it from time to time. I like Silders. Um, just go and turn your entity shadows off and your horses should stop T-posing. I'm gonna have to figure out how to do that on Silders. I'm sure there's a way. I just don't know where to look. You are going to eat that entire hay pile before I even finish the video. Move away from the hay. No. Move Steve. Move away from the hay. You do not need to eat more hay. Okay, you are fine. Everything is fine. <laughs> Steve, move away from the hay. Is Steve gonna finish this entire hay pile before I end this video? Maybe. Steve, you're scaring me. Steve, you're scaring me. <laughs> Steve, you cannot eat. You cannot eat all of this hay. <laughs> Please. <laughs> you know those like comments of like, my horse eats this much. Steve just ate an entire pile of hay. <laughs> I can't stop. I can't stop him. Steve. <laughs> Steve, don't do it. <laughs> oh, Steve, you've already eaten enough. Why are you eating more? <laughs>
I'm gonna have abs after this video. I just laughed so hard. But I think Steve is a little bit bugged because Steve has an endless pit of a stomach. I've never seen a horse eat that much. All right, a really quick check in with Steve. How much of the grass has Steve cleared? Oh my gosh, Steve is making progress on this field. Steve, for your own safety, I am going to remove you from this field. I don't feel safe leaving you out in the field. Digging right in. There goes the, there goes the slow feeder. That wasn't very slow, the feeder. <laughs> I think I know why the grain bin isn't working. The same hotkey that I used for carry on is the same thing for the bins. Yeah, so if you shift right click for carry on, it picks up the bin. I changed my hotkey. So now it's just uh, a different hotkey. So now I can actually open and close the bins. You just shift right click. That took me so long to figure out because I was like, why is this not working? So you can't mix the grains for the rose feed and the sweet feed, but you can like fill them up. And then you can just right click to get a scoop. And however much you put in there, um, you can get all of the, the sweet feed back with the scoops. There you go. And then you can also put the scoops back. That way you don't have to keep like a chest filled with sweet feed. You can just go to the bin and grab the scoop. And then the scoop disappears when you place it into a grain feeder so no like keeping a bunch of empty scoops around you know well cool. i really like that feature if only i knew how to work it for the first like five minutes of the video <laughs> so the only like major bugs i can see is that some horses just eat constantly and choose to eat things around the pasture like grass instead of the hay steve luckily for me um is not picky he will eat both hay and grass in fact he will eat until he cannot eat anymore i don't know when steve will ever stop eating oh my God. Look at this horse sleeping right over the little ponds. Finch. Oh, there's Finch. Sleeping over by the trough. It would be cool if their eyes could close, but I think that's more of texture and modeling than anything. Um, I'm pretty sure they would have to retexture all of the horses with closed eyes, which wouldn't be a big deal, but would be work. Oh my god, it's time for me to sleep, I guess. Oh my gosh. <laughs> if you guys have updated your SWEM in game, what do you guys think of it? Have you encountered any of these bugs that I have? And are you excited for the food update? I was mostly excited for this just because of the realism of horses walking around. Like I mentioned earlier, a lot of my videos where I got drinking and eating scenes were only when people were in wild horse mode on the back of the horse, invisible and making the horse doing those animations. So the fact that they're already in the stage of development with swim, where you can see your horse eat in person and you know in real time is crazy to me and I'm really excited for what future updates they will bring to the mod. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you all have an amazing rest of your day. Stay healthy and safe and hydrated, and I will see you in the next video or stream. Feelings, press rewind, and see what